Alright folks. So we're on to the next step of our Tenkan adventure. So we have our Tenkan that we uh, worked on the other day. Now we're going to drill the holes. So I already marked it and then I protected the markings with painter's tape. So make sure that you offset the first hole. This is for ease of playing that is, you know. So um, especially for like rig, smaller hands like mine, I like to offset the, the bottom hole and the third hole. So um, two and four and five are generally straight for me, but depending on you, whatever feels most comfortable for your hands, please adjust it. So this is me. So we're going to be drilling the first hole. Here we go. Mysterious sound. Second hole, straight. Let's get some vacuum in. Feels good on the hands. Easy. Sounds perfect. Next hole. Third hole. Offset. These offsets are about five millimeters from the center. The next is down the chip on the inside. Feels good on the hand. Perfect. Next, fourth hole. Straight. Feels good on the hand. Yeah, great. Now for the back hole, always good to have your celluloid film negative. Get the exact center. So, some people like to have their thumb hole like to the left a little bit, especially if you're right-handed. <laughs> a lot of people like to just slightly off to the left. That's my preference. So... But... Let me feel it. 
Yeah. Actually, center is good for me. <laughs> I'm going to put it down. It feels, it feels nice. If it's a n standard shakuhachi, I, I like, uh, especially if it's a longer flute, uh, uh, and the stretch is longer, I like it uh, off of some, some left wing. But the spread on this is not too, too demanding, so. You go that's it so uh the holes they're generally there's no no major tuning things to do though 10.5 mill, millimeter diameter is sufficient enough for because the, the pitch is so like flexible on these that you don't really need to tune it too hard. So uh, just a matter now of refining the Utaguchi and perhaps putting a coat of lacquer on the outside, on the inside, and then you're good to go. So let's see if there was a little tape on here, so I'm taking out bits in there. And um, yeah, polish up the outside. And yeah, it's good. So I'm gonna give you actually. Let's do a little bit of a full clean. some sandpaper. Three twenty grit. I'll just go around the edges of the hole. Smooth up the hole. Here we go. Feels good on the hands now.
right, that's it. Now, with the Gucci, the more you develop this part, the more stronger the sound will be. And then, of course, uh, treating the bore helps a lot. Maybe put in a, a layer of any kind of lacquer that you prefer, even like an epoxy resin through the bore. It will seal up the bamboo nicely and it's gonna make the sound a little bit brighter. There you go. All right, thanks for joining me.